This is the scene outside the FBI headquarters during what was supposed to be a massive protest with veterans and patriots showing up. No one showed up. Now on to 1776, from what I have read online, their porta potties are now open to the public, the ones they had in DC, and there's a line. So it sounds like if 1776 had simply opened those porta potties and the public could use them, they would have gotten bigger audience than they did their entire time in DC. Literally, their protection over their porta potties might have doomed them to have no interaction with people, and that is hilarious. Now, there is a big split in 1776. People do not want to go back to Bunker Hill. That's very obvious. X-rays heading up to Niagara Falls. A significant number, which remember, there's not many people in 1776, so any is a significant number, are staying at Burke Lake. They're going to be paying for their own camping space, their own gas, and their own food to go do January 6th stuff. Like, go to those little, like, nightly things. Basically, that Santa went to that and basically lost part of his cult to it, from what it sounds like. But they are going to still have their Constitution classes, which are done by non-historians that are basically just fanfic. Uh, that will be Monday. That's still supposed to be planned. And if you're wondering, well, who is going back to Bunker Hill? Well, of course, Hippie Mama and Big D. We know for sure they're going back. Uh, this, by the way, is the truck that was bought with Big D's legal funds. Uh, yes, they did put decals on it, as you would expect. So just so everyone is aware, it wasn't like a... A, a beater truck to get them here or there. It wasn't a huge, like a, like a really rough used truck they got cheap. This is what they bought, okay? Let, let's get that clear. This is what they use the legal money for. And you might be wondering, well, what is Big D doing now that he's back in Bunker Hill? Well, why don't we watch Defender of Ants? I'll link him in the comments, but either way. Let's watch Defender of Ants and see how Big D is doing. So this is the, uh, I guess, the important work that 1776 needs to do. Yeah, try to threaten people with a little bike, yeah. Now, am I wrong? Or was Big D the one that drunkenly fell off a bike in a clip with the People's Convoy? Or was that with 1776 at that point? But I seem to remember that. Hmm. <sighs> but yeah. This is, uh, this is their camp. This is how they react to people counter-protesting at their camp. Uh, last night, Anarchy Princess and Lori said they had rocks thrown at them. There was an attempted swatting last night, so... Yeah, this is, uh... This is where your, uh, money goes. If you donate to 1776, you can get them these little bikes and then get some gas for them and do this, I guess. You can also get themselves some nice trucks and... You know. Your money is well spent, as you can see. 